My name is Vincent Rapando. I'm the coordinator of this Kariobangi Community Kuka project on behalf of the corporates, the civil society and the UN agencies that are supporting this project. The project was started by as a, as a self-help group, a CBO called Kariobangi Waste Management Alliance that was uh, it's a, con a combination of, of, of 11 groups. The project was launched in 2016 by the governor the co of, the, of the county government of Nairobi and the main idea was to bring youth together. We engaged some of our partners uh, in the name of uh, one of them, Mr. Rapando Vincent, who in turn also gave us some clues and ideas of how to form a company and the company's name was uh, Rasilimali Enterprises. Normally we work with the footballers, the community can organize any event, any meetings, they can come and meet here. We cook for them and uh, things like chapatis, dengus. And to make money through a social enterprise approach, through what, I, what, what, the, the, what you call the shared value approach. So we converted 11 CBOs into one social enterprise and the main idea for them to make money through cooking from this. Mr. Rapando really put us on the board whereby we came to meet Mr. Chandaria who funded this project at a, at a 4.5 million with some other partners uh, like KCB, Safaricom Foundation and other corporates that we normally appreciate for this kind of assistance. Um, before then, youth were having some challenges because uh, the community was collecting garbage, but the problem was this garbage was being, was, was being dumped at Dandora dump site. So we came up with an innovative idea, how do we make sure that the garbage that's come from the household does not go to Dandora dump site. That's why we, gave, we came up with this project and uh, we converted this youth for the youth to run it. So we got support from uh, quite a good number of corporates, so we put together funding to that tune of 4.5 million that was used to put up this cooker, was, was used to put up the, the shell of steel, which is being used like a restaurant. So youth are making money. Uh, on top of that, other organizations came in and they even put up this container that used, 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 are going to use this as offices so that by the time they are making food here for sale, they can also have other streams of making money. Actually, the project have really assisted us. We normally generate almost 20,000 tons per, per week of garbage. So it is indeed true because part of the, part of the garbage it goes to Dandora, but the youth utilize almost 20 tons of garbage on a daily basis. What they do, they bring in the garbage and they do the sorting because the cooker can only use biomass. Through burning these things here, and we believe this is uh, another way of minimizing, being on environmental friendly. We are not using trees, we are not using uh, firewoods, but we are using our waste papers. And uh, when lighting it, it, it takes uh, roughly one hour. And uh, the burners heat at, uh, at around 800 degrees Fahrenheit. This is after heating the burner. The burner is now hot, the water is very warm. It can be used by some of our players after doing so their practices. They come and take a bath. Right now, we had 20 members, 10 members who are trained. We also have another 20 members who are always working on this place, bringing the waste. Some of them bring the waste. The benefit itself makes our members add some skills on what to do with the project. In terms of benefiting, I'm one of those, I'm one of those people who is also baking and operating the restaurant as an individual, so I get some money from here so to sustain myself. If it is possible, it can be replicated somewhere else in some places, especially in the slum places. So when it's cool, when you want to take the ash, you can take it from the downside. So the ash, we put it in a sack. After pushing the ash, ash in a sack, we, we put them in a sack because the, most of the, our sporting fraternities, the footballers, the soccer team, normally use it to draw the ground. So they buy it at a, at a low fee. It also helps them very much. First of all, we want, we want to thank Mr. Vincent Rabando for mobilizing the Chandaria group of companies and East African deliveries. 
and other partners to fund this project at a cost of 700,000. It's a water tank where reformed youth of the group can work as car wash servicemen. They can also sell water to the community and they can also be functioning as a place where people who want to change and to learn how to hustle can come and get knowledge from. We sell 20 liters, a gallon of 20 liters at five shillings. And that money is saved and is loaned out to a member of the group. Projects has really because uh, uh, the youth have uh, proved that this project can work. And the main idea is uh, this, the same project should be replicated through a shared value collective impact approach. We should replicate the same idea to other, other parts of the country.